Hi guys, today we have a new problem under Visual Studio Code or Atom Editor or any editor for websites or projects in general. But today on the Visual Studio Code exactly, using FTP simple extension and facing a new problem which is command not found. Let's solve this problem. So this problem have found in Stack Overflow forums and a lot of guys have replied with some solutions but none of these solution is worth it. Why? Because the problem is simple but the solution is more and more and more simple and not hard. So to solve this problem you must just downgrade your version of the extension. And I have an information for you guys. If you have any problem on the extensions of the Visual Studio Code or Atom or any kind of editors, you must just downgrade the extension to the older versions. Like the versions of years ago, one year, eight months, six months. And do not use the versions of the 20, day, 20 days ago, f 45 days ago, something like this. So to solve this problem, we have just need to go to the view on the panel of the Visual Studio Code to access the extensions panel or just type Control shift x to access this panel too as a shortcut for sure so you're gonna type ftp simple and you're gonna find the manage button and manage button have a lot of choices and one of them which is useful on my video which is install another version. This means that you need or you want to downgrade the version of the FTP simple because you have a new problem and you need to downgrade to work with the extension without any problem. So click on the install another version and select the 070 version which is I'm using it right now even if the developer which is homie2833 uh, have solved the problem on the last version uh, but I don't use the last version for the reason uh, of having new problems in the future so I keep using 070 which is the best version of FTP sample. So click on it and wait for VS Code to install this version for you and will request a new reload to reload the, the Visual Studio Code and do not update and disable the automatic update of the extensions. You can disable it from the settings. So unclick on the reload required, the editor will reboot or reload in fact so now we're gonna try to config our uh, configuration or FTP simple JSON file. So now we're gonna try to configure the FTP settings file, which is FTP simple JSON or FTP simple temporary file JSON. And click on the config or FTP connection settings in order to configure our file. And the file opened successfully and you can type the name, you can type the port, the FTP and username and some of these and you can remote your directory open to workspace uh, which is just localhost and I will reconfigure it with my own uh, file which uh, I have it here, uh, my backup. So uh, that's it guys, the problem is solved. Uh, uh, try to subscribe on the, on the channel and try to like the video and if you don't like the video you can do dislike and uh, if you have any problem face any problem you can just put your comments or your opinion on the comments box try to share the video with your friends with the developers uh, you can put it on stack overflow to tell the developers that this problem is really solved see you guys on another video and try to be smiled all the day and happy because life it's easy